Hey Rangers, welcome to the Super Unimportant Reviews. My name is Shin. Steve, what the hell is this? Uh, well, okay, so there's been people complaining that you don't have a character in the series, because I, I, I pretty much do all the voices except for the jurassic Raptor. <laughs> That's Jessica. So I thought, what better suited character for you than Mothra? Does that look like Leo Mothra to you? Is that a guy? How am I supposed to do a girl's voice? I have faith in you. Faith in what? I, anyway, okay, we're just going to get back into it. Okay, Mothra, what are we doing today? Steve, seriously, I'm not doing a Mothra okay, voice. Okay, we have to get this video done. Stop breaking character, all right? Let's go. Let's go. Okay, Steve, you know what? Two things. For one, today we're doing my favorite movie. Do you know why? Because I die in it. Yeah, I said it. I die. What about it? And second, no, I'm not doing this, Steve. Sounds like somebody's got some anger issues. You know what? You can go f*** yourself. You know, I, I did the voice, right? Uh, point your finger a little bit towards the, your way. Uh, a little, now, bend it down a little bit. Yeah, same goes to you, buddy. <sighs> All right, here, hold your mouth. <laughs> hold your character. Just start thinking about the way your character's going to sound while we get into this section here. I am a beautiful butterfly. All right, so today we'll be going over the Nuka Godzilla 1964 figure. Which, for the packaging, you got the poster of the kaiju on the front of it, on the side. You know what's good about that shot, Steve? Mothra gets obliterated. You go back, keep turning it. Turn it Yeah. I'm literally trying to do this in character. You're not helping. <laughs> I feel like there's a reason why Steve does these videos all by himself. <laughs> And once you open the package, you get a figure of the 1964 on the side with the egg, which we never really noticed in the initial review up on the Geek Chest. Also, before we get into the figure, thank you, NECA, for providing us with this figure to review. We greatly appreciate it, right, Mothra? All right, go. Deep time now. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want from me? Just pull I'm a PG for my gift. Let's see, Helen. Um. Huh. I can't. realize I have like three voices. It's just like alterations in all of them. Cake's a lie. I am a beautiful butterfly. Well, I am a beautiful butterfly. Damn. That's pretty good. We can roll. You can kind of roll it like, um. Oh, what's that thing? That little blue thing from Bear in the Big Blue House, if you remember. I am a beautiful butterfly. I am a beautiful butterfly. No, I can't do that. <laughs> I can roll my R's, but not like that. You want to do this all the time? All the time. That's actually really good, Steve. I know. <laughs> all right, you just talk like just talk normal for the bug. Huh? Just talk normal for the bug. It's okay. I'll for the Rangers will forgive you if the bug sounds like you. Hell, half the like whenever I usually do normal Godzillas, most of the time it's just my voice. Yeah, that's fine, Steve. Okay, what do you want from me? Uh, I don't remember the line anymore. Overall, it's not a bad figure. It's probably one of the best Nekas figure out in last. I don't mean talking like break down the figure at the end. That's just, that's outro. It's not, no, it's, we start talking. You know, you know what? Just details. Start with details. So starting with Godzilla's head, you get a little bit of that upward look like you see in the film with the predominant eyebrows and the way he has that bulldog kind of face. But also he looks like he's been sleep deprived and is stuffing something in his cheeks. Not sure what it could be. Only real qualm is when you open the mouths, the way the back portion of the cheek is set. It kind of looks a little off, but nothing too drastic to say that it's a negative. Steve, you know what the good thing about this figure is? It comes with the beam effect. Where is it? That is a good question that we'll have to save for another day. Steve, what the hell is this? Okay, we just said I, we're already breaking characters. You're not allowed to break it too. Stop it. Anyways, yes, I grabbed the 62. Hold on a sec. I think we're, we're almost there. There's so many toys on the floor. I don't know where I put... Oh, maybe... Wait, wait, wait. Hey, found it. All right, cool. Here you go. Sticking in his mouth. 
That sounds wrong. <laughs> a little bit. So when you have the breath effect in his mouth, doesn't look too shabby. Though now that I think about it, it almost looks like the silk spray that comes out of the moth. That son of a bitch. Moving down to the dorsal spines, you see what looks pretty accurate to the film with the overall gray coloring. Well, like, out, what would I call that? Hey, it's called frosting. And as the overall slender figure that you see in the suit with his long slender legs and also his tail that is not a bendy tail. Get some articulation. Sort of similar to me. Though I will state it is a little easier to keep him more upright than my gargantuan girth. That's what she said. And then for the articulation with the assistance of Steve, the head can look about that far, down about that far, a little bit side to side. Well, actually a lot of side to side action. But the mouth opens and closes. Arms can go... How about that far? How about that far? All the way around. Get some bend at the elbow. Rotation at the elbow. Rotation at the hands. Bend at the hands. Waist. A little bit side to side. Rotation. Make sure to watch out for that dorsal spine on the back there. Legs can go outwards. Yeah, about that far. Inwards. About that far. Can bend at the knee. Rotation at the knee. Rotation at the foot. Forward and back motion as well. And the tail can pretty much do whatever the hell you want. So overall for the 64, pretty solid addition to the NECA collection. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold up, hold up. This one of the best editions, Steve. You meant to say Shin. Yes, I'm sorry. It's one of the best editions, Shin. It's supposed to be like one of the best editions, Shin. One of the best editions, Shin. Unlike some other NECA that we don't talk about here my god nightmares purples <laughs> oh god save us well to be fair it is no neck of shin wait you mean it's worth something you know if i wanted that kind of attitude i would have just kept red to do this video hate to say it but he's definitely more of a professional than this thing i'll show you son of a bitch Hey, oh, no, no, don't take the guy. <laughs> I was sorry. I'm sorry. You know what, Steve? I've done one of these videos, and I'm already sick of the stupid show. I'm not doing... Did, did you just really throw that against the wall? Maybe. Um, so... By the figure? By the figure. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Help us defeat those kaijus by hitting that like button. Subscribe to Kermit Ranger today. We also got an Instagram, Patreon, oh. Pinterest, and Facebook. Where, where's you, Shin? Where's you, Shin? You He's guys... coming back into this. <laughs> He's coming back into this. You murdered him, you monster. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? He can come back for this cutscene. <sighs> Let me see if I can find his parts. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think I found your job. <laughs> we'll sort of fix this. Help us defeat those characters by hitting that like button. Subscribe to Marine today. We'll see you guys in the next video. I hurt. Bye bye.